So here we have the Canyon Bay 28 Hybrid. First time we get a look at this one. A lot of firsts here at the Fort Lauderdale Boat Show. We want to take you aboard to take a look around. So this is a nine foot three beam. It's got twin 225 Mercury Verados, twin Minn Kota Talons, twin live wells. Right down the, the transom. Storage space additional here. Now this boat holds 139 gallons of fuel. Actually does four miles per gallon from what the owner is telling us. We want to definitely see that in person, but pretty impressive all the way around. Boat weighs about 6,600 pounds roughly, this one in particular. You can see it has some pretty interesting features, a full uh, second station right here done by Quality T-Tops. So if you look around and actually see from there, you might be able to get a good look, maybe stand on the, on the cap. Really nice work, very custom stuff. So jumping up on that and getting that vantage point from up there is terrific while you're fishing. Um, this is a big platform, 28 feet, nine foot three beam. So it feels like a big boat. You got the lower gunnels, like, uh, like the hybrid format. We got a Captain Hunter's Addiction steering wheel. So check that thing out. Really cool finish, paracord. And then very simple console here with the Garmin MFDs down the center, windshield and some lighting to give this all a very nice touch. So you got your helm seats here, adjustable seat backrest, JL audio, sound system throughout, tons of speakers as you can see here through the transom area alone. And then a bit of tackle, storage, here you got for your fluorocarbon. Wow, look at that, spot for your LEDs. So this is actually, I believe the owner's boat, so he's got it rigged and does quite a bit of fishing. Your LeBrock chairs. Work your way this way. You got fresh and raw, raw water wash down. Your console cabin space. You got your battery switches, your JL lamps, VHF out there. Then it looks like some storage underneath. We won't get into all that right now. Removable Yeti cooler down here in front of the console. So you can take this in and out. It's actually quite nice. If you don't want it there, you can remove this and have a ton of space up here towards the bow. We'll open a couple of these hatches and see what we have underneath. Basically storage throughout. You got an elevated platform here and then the full forward platform. Crack one of these open. Rod storage all the way towards the bow. So you can stow away all your rods and you got a lockable latch right there. Good size box here on the platform towards the bow. And then you put this down, you got tremendous casting platform here not taking away from pretty much any space of the boat. And then you got the Minn Kota Ultera trolling motor and your ankle locker. Lastly, right here at the bow. So really cool boat. Love to see these hybrids. He says it runs incredibly well. Hopefully we'll be able to link up with them and see how it does. Personally, we'll bring you along for that ride as well. But if you have any questions about the Canyon Bay 28 hybrid, drop them in the comments. We'll try to answer them as we see or experience it here throughout the show. And anything we can't answer, we'll get the owners to answer directly. So like, subscribe, share this content if you're enjoying it. We appreciate you guys and we'll be doing much more of this here at Center Consoles Only.